All right, happy St. Patty's Day. Uh, today is March 17th, 2020. So our workout today is gonna start off with 20 alternating arm and calf raises. So for these, you're just going to extend one arm up overhead. So this would be one, two, three, four. After you do that, you can either go for a quick jog or two minutes of burpees. On the burpee, remember ideally we want our chest and thighs touching the ground, keep the feet wide, jump back, jump up, jump and clap. Okay, so nice consistent pace for two minutes. After that, we're gonna get our core work in. 30 seconds of work, 30 seconds of rest, three rounds. Uh, the three movements are, the first one is a backpack tabletop sit up. So for this, you're gonna have your backpack with you, you're gonna get in this tabletop position. You're gonna have the backpack resting on the knees. From here, you're gonna come up, grab it, go back behind you, sit up, tap behind you, sit up, and repeat. After our sit-ups, we're gonna go walking planks. So you're gonna set up, feet are gonna be wide, tall plank, go down to the forearms, Come back up, switch sides. After that, we're gonna go back to our backpack for a Russian twist. So, you're gonna hold the backpack like so. Ideally, the feet are gonna be raised and you're gonna twist all the way over side to side. If you have a dumbbell or kettlebell at home, what you can do is hold it, interlock those uh, fingers and then go side to side. After our core work, we have our wad. 20 minute AMRAP, so as many rounds and reps as possible. First 17 backpack snatches. So for these, you're gonna hold the backpack like so. Make sure the back is nice and flat, butt back. From here, I'll explode up, press out overhead, come back down, lock it out. If you have a kettlebell at home, you can do kettlebell swings here, or if you need to modify the chest height, you can also do the same thing with your dumbbell. Again, interlock those fingers through the legs, lock out overhead, or chest height. Next, 17 backpack thrusters. So for this, you're gonna hold the backpack like so, Squat, press, squat, press. If you have a kettlebell, I would suggest holding it like this, squat, press. If you have two dumbbells, great, you'll just hold them both hands. If you only have one, I would hold it like this, squat, press. And then lastly, we have 17 tuck jumps. Uh, these are in place of box jump overs. So for the tuck jump, I want you to go butt back, jump, and bring those knees as high up as you can to your chest. If you have access to stairs, then you can do step ups. If you don't have stairs and you can't really jump, I want you to go high knee, okay? And you're gonna do 17 per leg, so 34 total. So that's one round. You're gonna do as many rounds as possible in 20 minutes. Be sure to post your score uh, in the comments below. Uh, have fun, and if you haven't already, please subscribe to our channel. Thanks.